Excellent. Hey, look, first of all, I want to just, just thank Sarah and her team. All right, um, it's always good to be here. This is my fourth um, year in Wellington. We've, I've done Auckland Wellington Christchurch for four years, and it's always good they put on a great, fantastic event. Okay, so if, can you just all stand up for me? Can, that be, can you just do that for me? Because what I want to do is, can you, can you put your hands together for Sarah and the team at BizZone? You know, because they do put on a fantastic event. All right, and the other thing is I want to applaud you, okay? I want you to put your hands in the air, all right? Turn it to the back of the room, okay? Flop it over and pat yourself on the back, okay? Because it takes special people to make a difference in their business, okay? You can sit down now, all right? You've made the effort. You've come out on a, a lovely Wellington day, Wellington at its best, okay? Um, to make a difference in your business, and that's what it takes to stay ahead of the crowd, right? Who here is in business or about, about to start a business to make money? All right, I'm in the right place. Okay, good to hear it. I'm a veteran entrepreneur, 25 years in business and marketing, and in the last five years, I've successfully registered 29,338 clients into my business system, okay? In the next 20 minutes, I'm gonna show you how to market your business online for free. Right, now I have a PowerPoint presentation here. Right, just so you know, that's me. Right, that's where I started. I'm a qualified chef by trade. I am not an IT geek or IT guru. I learned everything I know through the School of Hard Knocks. Right, so, and just being able to relate to people and get business done. Okay, one thing I've learned in being in the IT industry, software, websites, is that they are truly your friend, okay? They're the biggest friend that you'll ever have online. And exploit them, every degree. Everything you can do with Google, do it. They provide most of their services for free and or low cost, and use them. How do we use them? Okay, first of all, what we want you to do is I highly recommend go to Google, right? Over in the corner here, it says sign in, all right? You can set up a Google account. Okay. Go in and set up a Google account. How you do that right, is set yourself up with a Gmail address first of all. Right? With Google, your Gmail address, you don't have to use it, just set it up. Right? With Google, your Gmail address is going to be like your golden key, your little password to everything Google. Okay, so what we do is we set up a, a, a Google account. How we do that right, is you click up on the top right hand corner and it'll bring you to this page here. You register, do whatever you think you need, enter your details, and that will give you access to a page that looks like this, right? And these are just some of the free services that Google can provide to you, okay? We have Google AdWords, which is what we call pay per click advertising. When you have, everybody here see, know, know who Google are, I'll, I'll just, Make sure make, everybody knows who Google are. I'm, I'm pleased to hear that. Okay, when you look at a, when you look at Google, you've got two sides of the page. You've got on the left hand side is what what we call organic ranking. Okay, jargon. I hate jargon. That's where it's how Google rank you as a business. They use all their algorithms and they look at your website and they they, they come up and they rank you. All right. On the right hand side is a thing called sponsored link. And they sometimes appear at the top of the page as well. Okay. That is what we call pay-per-click advertising, Google AdWords. Okay, can be very, very cost-effective. You've got to know how to do it, but, right, Google will teach you how to do it. Go into Google. They don't make it that easy to find out how to do it, all right, but you can go there. There's a whole, you can even become a Google AdWords professional. Go through a whole course and learn how to do it so you can do it for other people. Okay, so it's all the information that you need to start advertising your business online using Google. Okay, we have alerts, Google alerts. You can set up an alert that if you're in the finance industry or you're in a particular industry and you want to find out what's going on in the world, every time somebody posts a new, a new subject or new new article on that particular subject, it will alert you and send you an alert that that's what's there. Okay, blogger, okay, Google blog. Right, great place to start. If you're looking for a website or you want to start with something, you want to get going, feel your way in the, in the industry, set up a Google blog. Okay? They're free. They don't cost a dime. You can go in there, get exposure. You can get your, 
Obviously, if you get a do domain name, it's going to cost you to get a domain name. But you can set up a Google blog, and it has some amazing tools in there. And I'll show you what it can do a little later on. OK, what else have we got here? Gmail. Well, Gmail is Gmail. It tells you you can interface with your PDA. You can look at all your emails on a regular basis. Unlimited, pretty much unlimited emails. Um, fantastic service. Again, it's free. Right? We have Page Creator, a website service. Google's own website service. Again, free. You can build a website there and use it as much as you like. It's probably more for your lower ends. It's, it's a little bit clunky, a little bit slow, but it'll do to get you started. It'll just, it's a good, good place to start and get you going. OK, Google Talk is a chat room. We have Google Video. All right. I'll just come back to Google. There's two, two lots of Google Video, and one of them I'm going to tell, tell you a lot more about. But anybody heard of YouTube? Right. Anybody know who owns YouTube? Google do. Okay? Google bought YouTube. Okay, Google Webmaster Tools. If you've got a, um, a website now, I'd strongly recommend you get onto, get onto Google, get yourself an account, set up Google Webmaster, and register your, your website with them. Okay, AdSense is another advanced um, system. You can actually get Google paying you money with AdSense. If you want to set up an AdSense business, you can do that and get them paying you money. All right, groups, history, pretty self-explanatory, iGoogle. Um, you can use that as your, um, your home page on, um, uh, on your computer. All right, OK. How do I set up a Google account? I pretty much told you that. But the easiest way, and I'm, you, know, you could come and ask me, and I could tell you all individually how to set up a Google account. But the best way to do it, all right, go to YouTube. Use YouTube like I use YouTube. I, I use YouTube like a... I use Google. I use it as a search directory. If I want to find something out or use, have a, um, a tutorial, I go to YouTube. Go and type in the subject you want, Google account. Go to YouTube, type Google account. I guarantee you, I know for a fact, that there's a video there that tells you exactly, shows you step by step how to create a Google account. OK? Show you how to set up a YouTube account. All right. <clears throat> Who owns YouTube? Told you that. Google do. OK, YouTube. Obviously, YouTube is another fantastic technology medium that we're all, we're all loving and using. And we think it's a younger person's medium. Rubbish. OK, it's absolute rubbish. OK, it is anybody's medium. Now, who's seen the ITM fishing guy jumping out of helicopters onto marlin, catching marlin from tyres and all that? Right? How do you think he got started? He now has a worldwide contract with the Discovery Channel, right? Running around the world, filming extreme fishing events because he posted a few videos on YouTube, right? I'm going to show you a little bit more of how to exploit YouTube without actually you creating a video. All right, we've all um, seen and how to create a Google account. Again, go to go. To, Go to YouTube and ask the how to how, type in how to set up a YouTube account, and they'll tell you. We can even set up things called YouTube channels. This is where, if you have more than one video, you can have them all collected in one place, and you can drive people, your clients, to your YouTube channel where all of your videos are displayed. And you can do tutorials yourself. You can do training exercises. You can just do general general social things. It's all there available for you to use. All right, and you say, how is this going to help me market my business? <clears throat> well, with Google, when you're looking at, sorry, YouTube, when you look at YouTube, we have a whole listing. All your listings are here, all the different videos that are available, right? But how, at the bottom, we've all, we all know who this person is. We're all familiar with Suzanne Boyle, all right? You know, extraordinary voice, all right? But this is one way that you can exploit other, other, th other people who are using uh, YouTube and in your industry, okay? It doesn't have to be in your industry. It can be a like, a like subject, okay? But what we do is we go to um, a page like this and just look at the number of views that that site has had. And that was taken. I, this presentation was done for Auckland. I believe that is up in the vicinity of around nine, 90 million now, right? Views since that went on YouTube, 
I'm going to show you how to have a piece of that action. Okay? <clears throat> what we do is at the bottom of every video that's displayed is an area for you to comment. So what we do is we place a comment on there about, hey, Suzanne Boyle is a great singer, but I'm better. Come and check out my, my video or come and check out my website. Okay? It's all somewhere a way of driving traffic that from other people to your business. Okay? It can be done quite easily. Post a video comment on your YouTube channel and put it on a link on it to somebody else's. I'm as 